The sheep is calling for justice. I said, meh, I'm gonna get you in my recipe. How about that? I will need for the ktif recipe, like you see, a lamb, uh, shoulder, very clean, and I took off all the, the extra fats and the undesirable skin. Now I have to stab it, like that, with the knife. To let our spices to go through the meat like that. Flip it at the other side like that. I have to add one tablespoon from uh, Smen. This is a traditional uh, product we use here in Morocco. It's very spicy, fermented butter. I have here half uh, onion, chopped, very fine. And uh, here I have one tablespoon from uh, uh, garlic. Yes, 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 yes. Here, well, a half tablespoon from uh, uh, seasoned uh, salt. It has a, a really nice taste. I said, why not to use it too? And here, this is uh, the first uh, tablespoon from butter. And I will add the second one, like you see. I have to rub the meat. Oh, it's so nice! <laughs> mm. When you rub the meat, you have to... Mm. Don't worry, I will add... Also, another ingredient. Now I... To... Speed the process. Yes, now I have to add my... I already have a uh, eye uh, measurement about uh, half a tablespoon from black pepper yes all right let's do that soak really well it needs the right massage oh so good I have to add uh, one uh, a half teaspoon, a uh, half tablespoon from ginger powder. Yes, yes, yes. And I will add now one tablespoon from honey, honey, honey. You are so sweet. Yes, a little bit. Okay. It would not make a big deal. We made it. All right, y'all. And this ingredient is very expensive. It is a saffron, Moroccan saffron. I toasted a little bit on uh, the heat on a pan. Not a pan, but uh, the cover of the pan. Now I have uh, like that between my hands a really flavor very healthy ingredients by the way like you see you have to like that I finished seasoned uh, my stuff now I have to yes cover it with the plastic wrap yes like that and I will let this stuff will chill overnight. The more it's marinated, the more it's so good. Yes, you have to let your meat, even if it's chicken or lamb or whatever, it should be uh, taking an amount of time. Well, I will keep wrapping the, with the plastic wrap, like you see. So it doesn't matter 
So, like that. Yes. Finish. Well, to the freezer overnight, uh, the fridge overnight, and I will uh, back uh, tomorrow to finish our death. Okay, honey. Welcome back. Today is the day. Well, took uh, the wrap off our death. Yes, like you see, I will turn the camera. I let it chilled really nice, and you see the juices, all of it. I will put the ktif here in the baking pan, and this sauce, and I will use it for other things. Well, I have to use my aluminium foil. Why? Because we need to cook uh, the ktif uh, inside and then we will need uh, a time to crisping up uh, the outside and get the brown color. We will do that together. Preheated oven on uh, 200 Celsius. I will let uh, our ktif uh, cook for uh, about uh, approximately exactly uh, the half an hour and I will check uh, on it uh, from time to time if it's uh, really cooked. So, uh, see ya! I hope you guys you will like today's recipe. Ktif, don't forget the like share subscribe to my channel hit the bell notification you will be notified with the new recipes as always keep positive very higher is the secret to success um wow the moment of truth mm.